Good morrow, ladies and gentlemen. We've got ourselves another wonderful matchup here. We've got uh, some, I can't pronounce this name, versus Larry Dane. Now, we do have ourselves a wonderful Terran versus Protoss, which, uh, as we all know, best matchup in the game. By and large, shout out to Tofu Gut Punch, by the way. He did just sub for five months. And in the red, hailing from Iyer, it's some Russian gibberish. That was a comment from Privateer Stro in chat, in case that offends you. Go hunt him down. Oh, look at that. He left a little heart for him. Oh, that's cute. He left him a little, little Protoss heart. Oh, that's, oh, that's cute. So what is this? Is this depot, gas, racks, gas. Are you doing my build? Is he going to BC rush him? Oh, snap. Two gateways. But wait, it's two gateways, but he doesn't have any gas. Uh, I thought this was a Diamond League game. He's expanding. What the? F um... The opponent is strong. Don't do anything reckless. Okay. Well, this was a great this was a great submission. Um He's Nexus rushing him. This is what you're supposed to do, by the way. Just pull a bunch of SCVs. Seriously, don't let the Nexus finish. If your opponent does this, there's usually nothing behind it. Yeah, he's just building zealots. So what what Protoss players do with this, good cancel. What Protoss players do with this is they just try to like recall four zealots with all the probes into your main and that will kill you by the way that kills all your so now the probe is gonna die to the reaper and the probe sees that the factory is almost done too this is especially tricky because he could get a hellion across the map before there is a stalker so that that just makes it awkward also no warp gate right so these zealots they can't really do anything, but they're still going to run straight across the map because honestly, what what else would they do in this situation? They're not going to really do anything at home. So just yeet them across the map. And the best case scenario, they kill some stuff. Worst case scenario, they just buy you time. They make sure that the Terran player is sitting at home, um, you know, to check for an expansion. He did build a Nexus in his natural. So we'll see what uh, our Russian boy wants to do. Captain Napalm in chat says it means Anakin. So here we go. Well, this map doesn't have any sand on it. it. Is this sand? What do you guys think? You guys can post in the comments what you guys... Is this sand in the map? Is is there sand? If there is, then I think it's pretty obvious who wins this game. Is it just dirt? Mazoro says gravel, not sand. Okay. Well, as long as there's no sand, I think we've got a pretty good chance here for the Protoss player, but... He has to make sure to take his fights on the high ground. Bob says it looks like sand. Well, these, these are the questions that give me nightmares. Two zealots in the natural. He does not know. I feel like his units probably saw them going down the ramp, but he just like didn't realize it. This is a pretty big opportunity. The zealots could actually walk in and kill kill shit now. Excuse me, kill shit now. It looks kind of, the map looks like Arizona. Arizona, the map looks like Air. Okay. Is it 112 degrees with a scorpion hiding in your unused boot you left in your closet for a month? Well, the Reapers and the Hellions are going to go do some damage. Yes, you have the force field. Okay. Warp gate is still really far. It's going to bring the Adept over. He's got the Twilight. Are these Zealots just going to run home? He just used Select All Army, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Okay, so he's going to keep two Hellions and a Reaper in the natural. Three Reapers jump into the main base. Probes are getting picked off. His fusion core is almost done, so getting a lot of damage oh, it's almost game ending damage really the failed nexus rush the failed nexus rush all of my why tell me why ain't nothing but a failed g's ain't nothing but a gg tell me why you tried to nexus rush me oh my god Nice. The Zealots were able to do something, ladies and gentlemen. They ran all the way home, killed a Reaper. Protoss player has nine probes. Uh, I'm going to have to be honest with you guys. It's not looking all that good for the Protoss player. As soon as this depot finishes. There we go. 
There we go. He's got a depot and a cyclone in production. And a battle cruiser. He's building a turret just in case. Protoss player's chances of survival presently at 0% in my professional medical opinion. But the building cyclone in BC will be all he has because the Reapers and Hellions do not want to engage the army here. Oh, he's going to hallucinate a Void Ray. Oh, oh, those Void Rays weren't. The Voids were Haluk. Weren't real. Haluk. Oh my God, he's starting charge. All right, here we go. Oh, no, there's still nothing. Oh yeah, because all of his units are in his opponent's base. Yo, Protoss player just taps out here, doesn't he? He totally saw the fusion core. Not the, Not the probes. Thanks, Jeff. Yeah, the probes are dead. Oh, unless he clicks on this assimilator one or two more times. Oh, this was a good game to, to get us uh, going here with some casting. Okay, is, does it end now? Here we go. You ready for this? There we go. Is he going to stay in the game? Yeah, the game's just got to be over. He's super dead. This isn't normal dead. This is advanced dead. <laughs> I don't know what to say. He did so much damage with the early harass. Well, careful there. Careful, partner. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. I'm going to have to save this in that one folder. I don't want Katie to see. Oh, boy. I'm loving everything about this. Ready? Ready? <laughs> Come on. You can do it. No? Okay, I'm making sound effects for you and you're not teleporting. Whatever. He's scared. He's scared to yeet himself in. Sometimes... Sometimes you got to be a little bit careful when you're yeeting yourself. All right. Next step is send the BC in and either keep the mules with them to try to repair or mine his minerals. It's a power move. It's a power move. It's like T-posing on someone. Use your repair mules to mine their minerals. This is so over. He's super dead. I'm incredible. Honestly, the most amazing thing about this game to me is that the Protoss player is still in it. He does have a significant number of units, but the Terran has tanks at home and he needs all of his stalkers to defend against this. I don't actually think this is enough stalkers anymore. What is it? What's this total at? Six? Yeah, no. It's five now. Oh, oh no. Well, GG, well played. Look at that. Look at that. Look at those manners. I love it. Well, remember kids, be careful when you yeet yourself. That comment courtesy of SK Orem.